This isn't really us. This isn't. This is very uncharacteristic for us, especially this year happening right now. So, you know, we're going to get back in practice. Just look at, watch the film, and just come out better next week. Coaches preach about the standard of Maryland football, and against ranked opponents, it's not very good. Uh, the last seven, this team is one and six, and has been outscored by 201 points. Like you said, Ohio State next week, and three out of the next five are ranked. What's it going to take for Maryland football to start real awesome wins against ranked opponents in the Big Ten? First thing to take is definitely discipline. I guess that's the main thing. <clears throat> Stand, our standard is playing with effort, playing with effort, playing with discipline. And I feel like that's where we lack today. We didn't play with discipline, and that's what's going to. We need to focus on that going forward because that's the first thing. You can't be anybody turning the ball over that many times, having that many penalties. You won't be able to beat anybody playing football like that. So. And that always comes back to discipline, as we always talk about. So playing with discipline is what we really need to do to have chances going into next week. Uh, 
Thanks, Jake. I um, just want to talk about Dante Demas and uh, what he can, you know, he lost, you lost, uh, you guys lost him in the uh, second quarter due to an injury, and talk about what he means to you uh, as a teammate. Yeah, it means a lot to me. I mean, he's the best player on our team, so, you know, when something like that happens, you know, it, it's bound to affect the team. So we're really just praying for him, hoping that he's okay. We really don't know what, what it is right now, but, yeah, man, when you lose your best guy, like, that obviously does something to the team because we all love him. You know, he's a, he practices so hard. He practices like a first-rounder. He treats everybody with respect. He's a great guy to be around. So it more so hurts me for him, you know, and, like, how great of a season he's been having so far. So I really hope he can get back. I really hope it's not anything too serious. Thank you, Jay. Thank you, guys.